I share the uh, Prime Minister's scepticism about the indicative uh, vote procedure. Indeed, I would go further and say it's a complete waste of time. Um, I'm sure that some who are proposing it uh, are genuine in their desire to find a a way through, but in actual fact, the majority, I think, actually wants to thwart the result of the uh, referendum. Um, like I've been out in my constituency over the weekend, and, and as she knows, it's a 70% Brexit supporting area. But uh, like me, the, most of them, when I, when I explain it, will, are prepared to back the Prime Minister's deal, imperfect though it is. But they do fear that there may yet be further concessions. Can she give an absolute assurance that she and the whole government will not agree to anything that further delays Brexit beyond a few weeks? Well, can I say to my honourable friend, and and I certainly, I want to be able to deliver Brexit and to do it uh, uh, within the extension that's been given us uh, to the 22nd of May. Any further extension would require uh, us to stand in European parliamentary elections. I think, as I said earlier, I think people would ask what on earth we we were doing if them having voted nearly three years ago to leave the European Union, we then found uh, they were then being asked to elect members to the European Parliament. I think they would say that we were failing to deliver on the vote that they gave, and I believe we have a duty to do that.